Galatasaray starting then their new European campaign here this evening. It seems such a short time ago that we were celebrating the end of the previous competition, but that is life at the top end of European football. And indeed, the mood here is one of great anticipation and excitement. We are ready to go again. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. Well, last year certainly had its fair share of memorable moments. Let us hope for the same, perhaps better, this time round. Well, when it comes to major European trophies, Peter, this is one of those eagerly awaited days on the footballing calendar. I think changes to the format have increased interest levels and the emphasis on, on victories is more pronounced now. And hopefully these two will go at it accordingly and we can enjoy this. the whistle and here we go and here's Immobile Arda Turan just brushed off the ball there Patrick van Arnholt Luyen Dama drives it forward and it's Faguli Faguli drives it forward Luis Alberto. Savic. Andres Pereira. Savic. Andres Pereira. Gara gets it back. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. Luis Felipe can hoist it clear. Patrick van Arnholt. It's not the game we were hoping for, Peter. I think both of these keepers could text about their respective uninvolvement. Barbel. Barbel. Luis Alberto tries to get it forward quickly. Savage. Hoists it forward. Diagne. Barbel. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Lucas is fouled. Gets a ticking off and needs to be very careful now. He just needs to find the control button on his aggression before the ref does it for him, Peter. But it's better. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Gara plays it long. Radu. Andreas Pereira. He's got away. Gets wrestled off the ball. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. It's a brilliant interception. Bubble. Bubble. 
He's left his man. Oh, no, it's an own goal. Oh, it's terribly unfortunate for them, and maybe we can attribute that to a, to a loss of focus. Galatasaray got some help from Lady Luck there. They all count. Well, you can't ask for much better than that, Peter. Bang, bang, two in double quick time. Good challenge. He just stood firm. And it's played forward. And it's Alberto. Luis Alberto really struggling to influence the game. Look, he could do with someone else taking responsibility to shift the target. He badly needs some help here. Gets a good foot in there. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Now it's Pedro. Goes for goal! Oh, that is rather wayward. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Markautesh. I think it's going to be the final action of the first half. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. It still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. It's a decent game up to now. Well, I don't mind admitting I wasn't expecting that. Still, I'm not complaining about a very good match with a, a surprising scoreline. Just don't ask me for a prediction, please. Galatasaray leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. So we're already into the second period. Galatasaray carrying a one-goal lead. Marcao Teixeira. Tiagne. Tiagne. Well, they're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. Forward it goes. Played out to the right. Felipe Anderson. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Diagne gets it back. Gara. And it's Faguli. Plays a clever pass. Luis Felipe is there to heave it away. He's gone for it! And in it goes! Two up and threatening to pull clear! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. starting to look very comfortable. 
Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Pedro. Across the field it goes. Felipe Anderson. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? And here's Immobile. Done very well to intervene. Keeper sends it forward. Savage. Yedlin. Diagne. That was good pressing. Forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. Shapes to shoot! Yes! And surely that settles it. Well, that always looked the likely outcome. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement, and when all of that is synchronised with the right pass, that's what happens. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Galatasaray take a three goal lead and they are romping out of sight. Lazio going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Savic looks to get on the end of this. Barbel. A Serbi. So 3 0 now, and sh oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Radu goes looking. Felipe Anderson going full tilt down the left. Felipe Anderson takes the long option. Radu. And the weighted pass. Hit long and direct. Lucas does well to read it and intercepts. Luis Felipe. Time added on will be two minutes. Lucas. Luis Alberto gets it out to the wing. Pedro. Looking for a decent ball in. Oh, the referee's booking him here for a dive. Listen, he can play the innocent as much as he wants, Peter, but it was fairly obvious to everyone here. He's got no hiding place. And that's it. Pretty much the ideal start. A win on the first day, a platform on which to build. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Well, pressure can quickly build on you if a positive result isn't achieved in your opening group match. Instead, they can take great confidence now from a very good victory and look ahead with real belief.